Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks. Somebody wants to, she's, they, I'm going to quit using um, they or the, I'm going to call it them, because I get so many emails and so many requests, sometimes I, uh, I get confused if it was a female or a male asking me a question. They want, so the white is there. They don't need the white there. They actually say they want to get rid of it. Like punch it out. Well, in, in lasering, we would have cut lines. So I'm going to move. Well, let me move my nudge factor to about five centimeters. And I'm going to nudge that out of the way. Then I'm going to nudge this out of the way. And there's another color, which I totally don't understand. Why there's two sets of colors. But we still need this background gone. So what we're going to do now, we're going to take this and we're going to left click, right click. That got rid of, so now you can, my yellow is the background. So it's showing through. I can bring this back over. And I'm pretty sure that's what she wants. Or they, they want, with the exception of the, the they don't need the lines. So we're going to, well, first of all, we're going to make everything a hairline. And it'll show you how better it looks. But then let's just take away. No, let's don't do that yet. What we're going to have to do, if I'm going to move this out of the way. Whoop. I'm going to move our color out of the way, and there's our tree. I'm going to move this over. I am going to get the Smart Fill tool. I've already got it set on that color because I was making sure it, this would work. But grab your eyedropper tool and hit that. Take a sample of that and then put that in there. It's going to take just a second. Now what you have to do is take your smart fill tool again and fill in all the parts. And I know it doesn't look good yet because uh, the outline, uh, but you have to fill in all these inner parts with the Smart fill tool could not get. And just make sure you get all of them. You can, on my slow laptop, you can actually go faster than you can do it. I mean, you can click on that and be moving, and it's, it's like a delayed reaction. One more. But because we don't want an outline, they're going to print this, I would think. We're going to, well, we're going to move that red. I'm going to lock my yellow box that I should have done him from the start. I'm going to try to get that red outline. Well, it doesn't matter. I'll move that out of the way. And what I, well, I don't know if the, if the line should be there or not, the red line. I'm going to leave the red line. So what I'm going to do, well, I can't leave the red line. Because I'm going to get rid of all my lines here in just a second. So I'm going to take this back. And I'm going to select everything. And I am going to right click. No outline. So now we have a tree. And there's your cut. Uh, if it's a that red cut line. So the, the font is not there. It's, it's actually. And we can kind of prove this if we unlock my yellow. And if we make this block blue, then you get to see what you're looking at. So I would, one, I would like to know what this other color is and what good it did. But I know nothing about printing. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.